Liverpool boss Jurgen Klopp stated in an interview with the BBC this week that his side can still succeed this season despite the summer spending of Chelsea and Manchester City. Klopp appeared to take a swipe at the two Premier League sides for their lavish sprees, which has included Chelsea. Beating Liverpool to £53 million Timo Werner, but insisted working together on the training ground can be very important too. But, have cracks begun to show in the Germans' usually enthusiastic demeanour? Here, Sportsmail has spoken to body language expert Judy James to get her opinion on the Liverpool boss. Jurgen Klopp uses the word calm in this interview, suggesting there is no story in the way that Liverpool haven't been investing heavily this season like Chelsea and City. But his body language is largely incongruent during this interview, suggesting a sense of being more defensive than defiant. His lockdown chic physical appearance here, with a straggly, graying beard, furrowed brow and disheveled hair doesn't help, and his facial touch and partial beard, stroke. Gestures look like self, comfort rituals that suggest some awkwardness or anxiety. Klopp performs 11 shrug gestures in one clip, and those shrugs become more emphatic in one, shouldered in the other. Shrugging can often suggest bravado rather than genuine. Calm in this shrug overkill could easily have given the suggestion of feigned indifference rather than the real thing. Swinging round in a chair as Klopp does here will give the impression of anxiety or impatience and when he speaks of other team signings Klopp switches from his normal friendly smile, displaying his perfect upper teeth, to bearing his lower teeth. That looks like a gesture of suppressed aggression or confrontation, suggesting that despite the verbal messages of no problem he is perhaps sitting on some resentment or anger.